Hi. Welcome back. Let's now take a quick look at what friend functions are. What is a friend function? As a general rule, private and protected members of a class cannot be accessed from outside the same class in which they are declared. However, this rule does not affect friends of a class. The friend function of a class is declared inside the class and is defined outside the class. It has the right to access all private and protected members of the class. Even though the prototype for a friend function appears in class definition, friends are not member functions of any class. A friend function overrides data hiding concepts and are defined external to the class definition. A friend function is not accessed with the object name reference, but it can access the members of a class only through its object reference. It can be declared either in public or private sections. Result remains the same. Using the scope resolution operator, double colon, functions of one class can be declared as friend function of another class. One function can be declared as friend of more than one class. Friend function can have arguments passed by value, as well as by reference. Syntax to declare a friend function is, friend, return type, function name, argument list. For example, friend, int, get emp number, emp data, ob, where, get emp number is the friend function, emp data, is the class, and ob is the object of emp data. This function will receive the object parameter ob, and will send back an integer value to the trigger, where this function was called. Syntax to define a friend function is, function name, argument list, body of the function. Here is an example definition of the friend function. It says, the function get emp number will receive an object of class, emp data. The object will be named ob. It will send back an integer value. Within the function it instructs to return the value of emp number from within the object, named ob. Syntax to call a friend function is, function name, argument list. And this is an example. n equals get emp number, obj. Note that here the function named get emp number is invoked without the dot operator. Instead, it is send with obj, which is an object of a class. This function will return a value which has to be stored in the variable n. We will now write a simple program to understand how the friend function works. Let's prompt the user to enter values for the following private data members. Name, employee number, and salary. Print employee number directly from the main function using a friend function. Here is the program code, and this is the class declaration. We declare two character arrays for storing employee name and employee number. Then there is the float variable for storing salary amount. Next is the visibility declaration, where it conveys that everything here on is publicly accessible. On line 8 is declared the accept data function, which returns nothing or void. It is defined outside the class declaration here. Purpose of this accept data function is to prompt the user to enter values for employee name, employee number, and salary drawn, which will be stored in their respective variable locations. On line 9 we declare the friend function get emp number, which will carry within it an object, named ob, of the class, emp data. This function will return a value, which is stored in a location that a character pointer is pointing to. This friend function is defined outside the class here. What does it do? It returns the value of emp number from within the object named ob. The declarations and definitions are over. Let's see what happens in the main function. On line 26, an object named obj of the class emp data is created or instantiated. On line 27, a pointer named n pointing to character data type is declared. On next line we invoke the accept data function of object obj. The function is executed. On output screen, the user is prompted to enter employee name. I type in James Barnard. It's stored in the variable name of object obj. Then employee number is asked. I type in jb007. It's stored in variable emp number of obj. Next, salary drawn by the employee is asked. I enter 50,000. It's stored in the location, salary. On line 29, get emp number, the friend function, is invoked. 
Note that this function is invoked directly, and not through the object.reference to function, as we had learned in the past. Object obj is passed to this function. Name of this object inside the function will be addressed as ob. Within the friend function, it is instructed to return the emp number stored in object ob. The emp number, jb007, is returned to the calling part of the main function. This EMP number is then assigned to memory location where the pointer N is pointing to. On line 30, we print a title message, and then on line 31, we print the employee number. The program then comes to an end. So in this program, we learn to declare, define, and invoke a friend function. We now conclude the chapter on friend functions in C++. In the next chapter, we will take another quick look at operator overloading in class and objects. See you in the next class.